Max Ernst was born on April 2, 1891, died April 1, 1976. He was a German but naturalized American in 1948 and French in 1958. He is painter, sculptor, graphic artist and poet. A prolific artist, Ernst was a primary pioneer of the Dada movement and surrealism. He had no formal artistic training, but his experimental attitude toward the making of art resulted in his invention of frittage, a technique that uses pencil rubbings of objects as a source of images and gratage. An analogous technique in which paint is scraped across canvas to reveal the imprints of the objects placed beneath. He is also noted for his novels consisting of collages. In 1912 he visited the Sunderbund exhibition in Cologne, where works by Pablo Picasso and post-impressionists such as Vincent van Gogh and Paul Gauguin profoundly influenced him. His work was exhibited that year together with that of the Das Junge Rheinland Group, at Galerie Feldman in Cologne, and then in several group exhibitions in 1913. In 1918, Ernst was demobilized and returned to Cologne. He soon married art history student Louisa Strauss, whom he had met in 1914. In 1919, Ernst visited Paul Klee in Munich and studied paintings by Giorgio de Chirico. The same year, inspired by de Chirico and mail-order catalogues, teaching aid manuals and similar sources, he produced his first collages, notably Fiat Motes, a portfolio of lithographs. A technique which would dominate his artistic pursuits. Also in 1919 Ernst, social activist Johannes Theodor Bargeld and several colleagues founded the Cologne Dada Group. In 1925, Ernst invented a graphic art technique called frittage, see surrealist techniques, which uses pencil rubbings of objects as a source of images. He also created the grattage technique, he also explored with the technique of decalcomania, which involves pressing paint between two surfaces. Ernst was also active, along with fellow surrealists, at the Atelier 17. Ernst developed a fascination with birds that was prevalent in his work. His alter ego in paintings, which he called Lop Lop, was a bird. He suggested that this alter ego was an extension of himself stemming from an early confusion of birds and humans. From the 1950s he lived mainly in France. In 1954 he was awarded the grand prize for painting at the Venice Biennale. He died at the age of 84 on April 1, 1976 in Paris and was interred at Pierre Lachaise Cemetery. For more video, subscribe our channel and switch the bell button all. I hope you like the video. Please like and share. Thank for watching.